And the summit also shining a light on the mental health of our children. Coming up, we speak with a student who's really helping to make a difference. We'll be right back. Welcome back. We've been talking about it. Mental health awareness is important, especially for students, which is exactly why the Broward Mental Health Summit is back in session, bigger and better than ever. Here with more are Amelia Valer Moncheri, Broward Mental Health Summit Committee member, as well as poster contest winner Brianna Vieira Alcalde. Both of you, thank you so much for being here. Amelia, let's go ahead and start with you. We briefly mentioned it a short time ago. The summit has grown exponentially in just one year. It has doubled doubled so we are at almost 600 attendees over um, 20 sponsors over 77 partner community ship agencies it's doubled exponentially yes it's a completely different format it's going to be amazing there's going to be opportunities for interaction and a lot of learning and growth there is it's exactly what we were looking for um, each session the breakout sessions are going to be very interactive it's going to be less of a lecture and more of a conversation sort of like what we're having right now and so it's going to be very interactive talking about getting people involved brianna as a student can you tell everybody how you were able to get involved in a pretty big way Oh, well, my Brace Advisor is always really involved with these types of events, and she let me know about this contest, and I didn't know much about it until I actually won it, and I was so surprised with how big of a, a deal it would be. Like, I, it was yeah. after I had, like, joined in. Okay, and this is the contest we're talking about. It's yep. a poster contest. Can you yeah. tell me about the poster, the creativity behind it, how you came up with it? All right, well, I really wanted to illustrate the importance of environment and the people you surround yourself with um, when you're going through some sort of mental turmoil. Um, that, like, it's important to surround yourself with people that help you um, or lead you to your recovery instead of hinder it. So that's kind of what I wanted to show with the girl, like, pouring not only on herself, but also, like, feeding the flower of another person and it said be another kind person. to your mind yes. it makes a big difference yeah do you guys expect a large turnout when it comes to young people tomorrow um, we have more um, partner agencies mm -hmm. and people in the field who are going to come out we do hope to have a lot of youth out as well but because it is during a school day it's, it's hard for them to come out but we we are going to have a lot of educators a lot of mental health counselors social workers who then can bring the information back to their youth that they work with right as a community being a able community. to get together and, exactly. and to kind of get the resources how helpful is something like this Brianna for you as a young person whether you're affected or do you have a friend to be able to have this knowledge um, I am excited to attend tomorrow and I, I'm not really knowledgeable on like what I'm going to see but I'm excited that I get the opportunity to see um, like the ways to help yeah, yeah ways to help way to stay focused and way to stay yeah. confident uh, you're quite talented thank you quite Very quite nice. the artist thank you to both of you for more information and the resources that will be available head on over to nbc6.com slash six and mix the events taking place in Pembroke Pines for exactly where you can go ahead and head to our website at nbc6.com slash six and the mix still so much more to come in the third annual all right next year yes. you guys come back <laughs>